Hi, welcome to another video from TW White & Sons Mazda. Today we'll be looking at CX-60. This is a Takumi Auto model, all-wheel drive. And this is a deep crystal blue color with silver alloys. Um, this is currently a demonstrator vehicle and it's just done under 200 miles. It's kept in a lovely condition and is used by customers on loan and they really loved it so this has been cleaned just this morning and as you can see it's sparkling now um, so this plug-in hybrid car uh, is i can do a 327 ps power and this is also a late 2023 model car so we'll be looking further into the car and exploring all the key features and as you can see yeah it's yeah we'll be uh, starting off with the rear tailgate and we work our way forward so to start off with the rear tailgate is um is electrical and on top of that we have the reverse camera with parking sensors on the bottom sorry for the background noise but yeah um so we open this boot up, you should be able to see Yeah, sorry Alright, yeah. um, yeah, you should be able to see some couple of packs This is a tow kit with the extra mats and the convenience pack This is also the power outlet of 1500 with the side netting And also an extra cigarette port And also, this is the um, this is the uh, lever for the seats, so to push it down. So, this, yeah, that's fantastic. Okay, and this is where the visors are located. It's quite easy, you can just mount it straight away. So it's good for privacy and also to block any uh, sun rays. So, yes. Okay, and it mounts perfectly and kept in position properly yes so and then this is the button to close the tailgate so now what we're going to do is explore the interiors um, the interior it's a white nappa leather and um, it's a has a rear heated seats which uh, which is uh, convenient for <coughs> White nap we, the white nappa leather can uh, be kept clean using anti um, antibacterial wipes. They will do the job. Uh, we're, ke we're keeping it clean and maintaining it. And also comes with a lovely texture of leather. And also um, the rear side has the option of controlling the heated seats. As you can see, there's uh, for both sides. And also there's a type C port on the bottom with another cigarette lighter port. And um, the side lights are located near the handles. And yes, so we were looking at the features in the front. So just by exploring this. Okay. So what we have over here are the mirror adjustments and on top of that the uh, windows. Uh, so this is a window lock. You can fold the mirror in and out once the um, engine is running. And um, this is the lock as well. So, so we've been moving on to the fuel lid opener. And on top of that, this is a parking sensor on default. It is on to turn it off the light will show and the right hand side is the sensors around the car and on the bottom are the seats um, uh, seat adjustment setter so you can um, do up to maximum two seats or uh, two seat preferences and you can set them up and finally the uh, boot opener for uh, so the tailgate opener for the rear from this button over here so you can open up the tailgate from here so let me just start the vehicle
it's a lovely cluster and it displays a lot of uh, information such as on the left hand side you can see it's currently on EV mode you can change it to uh, petrol mode once uh, once you press onto the MI drive and you can change it up and down to the normal sport and off-road along with the EV so it's currently on normal mode yep and um, you can see that it's done 191 miles and um, also it has the uh, volume control with the uh, changing tracks and uh, attending phone calls on the right hand side we have is the cruise control um, as cruise control and um, a link a link lane departure and also on top of that the um, maintaining distance between other vehicles in front so this is our entertainment unit and uh it's a it could it supports wireless apple carplay and android auto you can connect bluetooth and you'll be able to use any of the features on the wireless carplay uh effic efficiently on our entertainment unit and this is the control for uh, the entertainment unit along with the volume button and shortcuts such as navigation and uh, music and uh, home, home button and you can add anything on favorites if you wish to have any contacts or like or any other like playlists that you would wish to add onto your favorite also this has a um, wireless charging unit with the cigarette port uh, the wireless charger um, it's a quick fast charger so it will be helpful for charging your phone without having to rely on any cords as a distraction and two cup holders this is the dual climate control so when we turn it on on buttons over here as you can see it's a dual climate mode um, it's synchronized at the moment so if you increase and decrease it will match both sides but as soon as the synchronizer is turned off you can adjust temperature on both sides as, as how you like and uh, this is a steering wheel heater with the um, heated seats and the coolant for I mean and the seat cooling feature so this is best during the summer times and uh, the left hand side is the AC uh, in the middle you can change the direction and um, what mode you would like and this is to control the speed yeah all right so from here you can see that the um, uh, leather, I mean, sorry, the cloth is very smooth and soft <clears throat> and um, stylized with a lovely design. And on top of that, yep, uh, you will have a heads up display. <laughs> sorry for the dog. Yeah, the heads up display will show a project to you the uh, speed that you're going at and also the speed limit on the left hand side at any location. So the maps are up to date um, and uh, to update any maps in future, you, what you can do is um, uh, get the SD card from over here and using the Mazda Assist app, you can update the maps. And there's also another two USB type C ports, uh, which supports all modern phones. And from here, you can see from the entertainment unit, uh, you can there's options like entertainment communication navigation and settings once you pair up your phone smartphone you'll be able to uh, control easily using the controls on the um, near the armrest and on the steering wheel so what we can do is just uh, look into the um, entertainment and play the FM station consumers I think you can overdo the glue about the consumer. Yes, they still feel under financial pressure, but the confidence is trending yes. up. Okay, so um, another cool feature this car has is the uh, panoramic sunroof.
to and this is how the roof looks like without any um without opening it up so to open it up you can just push it down push it down and it opens up very smoothly and has both front and rear side um the roof only opens on the front side so if you push again you see that sunroof opens up and it's a lovely view from here perfect for summer and uh, brightens up the interior so let me just close this This is closes the window and push it again. The whole sunroof gets closed. It displays the airbag lights and also the front lights. Yep. And uh, <clears throat> yeah, so about um, if you wish to know further more about this car, please contact us anytime we'd be more than happy to assist you and and also if you would like to would like to test drive this vehicle please uh, feel free to ask um, um, so if you like this video please leave a like uh, if you have any suggestions please um, do so by commenting and I hope to see you soon thank you this is AJ I'll see you soon in another video. Cheers.